Yeah, um, I'm, I'm really happy. I think uh, we took some uh, some real positive steps forward, and and, and built on, um, on on what we did last week. So, uh, whilst the I mean, whilst the scoreboard says otherwise, I was, I was really proud of the boys' efforts, and, and I think we're heading in the right direction. So, uh, we've talked about how the big goal of this campaign is to look up qualifications. Uh, what have you seen over the last two weeks? Two pretty tough games. How are you looking you know, going into these two games at the time? Um, I think uh, we're in a good position, um, but by that I mean uh, there's going to be some difficult selections to make from the coaches, and I think uh, you know, the, the players have, have made our job a little bit harder. So um, yeah, that, that, that's what I'm seeing at the moment, and um, I think uh, we've got a great, you know, uh, even, even stronger foundation to work from. Now. How do you rate your local players? I bet three or four men. Uh, you had them with the way they perform. Yeah, absolutely. You know, um, everyone that was selected into this Mono Samoa was uh, was selected for a reason or chosen for a reason. And um, you know, the, 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 whether they're from from Samoa, from uh, Christchurch, or, <laughs> or, or 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 from Japan, um, you know, we uh, um, we we're trying to create an environment where. Regardless of where you're coming from, and some the expectations are there, and, the, and, the, and there are standards to, to be held. Mm. Michael, um, one view of the game that uh, cost us um, Well, as um, as coach said, um, I think uh, we showed a lot of heart, and we showed um, what we're capable of when we can hold the ball. Uh, I think. Um, Obviously, our, our lineup wasn't wasn't very strong tonight. We lost we lost a lot, quite a bit of ball there, so that's that's going to be one area that we're going to look to address because um, we worked quite hard to get into good positions and then um, just gave up some easy ball there. So um, next week we'll look to, to fix that up. It, it, it's hard enough to play with 15 men, so yeah, it, it, it's something we'll address, and, and we've got to look at the at the two incidents. I think um, you know the uh, the pleasing thing was is that, uh, you know, that there, there was no malice intended, and there were professional fouls. And when you're playing at, at, at such an intensity and, and playing against a quality opposition, you know those uh, those are those are a lot of one percenters that that could cost us dearly. So. It's great that we're learning those lessons this week rather than next week. It must have been nice uh, for a little bit of common sense when you know, just the shoulder to the head wasn't you know, nothing came today. Oh, absolutely. I think it's, uh, you know, it's, it's great for the game you know, that, that, you know, that we are using our common sense to, 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 to make the rulings and um, yeah, that's a credit to the referees. Michael, first two games under the coach, um, how have you done He's been awesome. Um, Especially as a former player, you know. <laughs> no, honestly, he has been. Um, yeah, you know, he's been driving our our, our mindset and and um, and the standards from the top, and and um, it's flowing through to the players as well. So, um, you know, it's been a big two weeks of learning, and that's been driven by our coach, and and um, I feel like we're in a good spot now, um, where we've built a really good foundation for for next week going into Tottenham. So. Um, and it's full credit to to, to Mapusua and um, the coaches that he's that he's selected under him as well. Are you really working together? Like rebuilding rugby in Samoa and back in Samoa? Are you where you want to be after two games? Sorry. Are you where you want to be after two games? Am I where I want to be? Um, I think. Um, I think. Yeah, absolutely. You know, I think the, these two games against the Maoris have. Uh, Put us in a, in a really good position. Um, you know, we're not, we've got a really important couple of weeks coming up with the World Cup qualifiers. So, um, whilst whilst there's uh, there's also a lot of other factors at play, um, such as travel restrictions and, and everything. But uh, in terms of the months I'm on, where we're at, I'm, I'm, I'm really happy.
Absolutely. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was a bit weird um, going out there and singing the anthem and, and doing the Siva and playing the game in front of in front of no one last week. So it's nice to hear some some cheering and, and our fans behind us. Um, yeah, it's quite loud actually. So hopefully we'll get um, a bigger turnout next week as well. Yeah, I mean, supporters are a big part of the Mount Samoa. You know, um, as, as Mount Samoa, we, we believe we, you know, this team belongs to the people, so it's, it's really important for us to have, you know, to have our people there. Mm. How would you rate uh, support from Tamanaya, Tom Country, and the other guy with your management? Uh, Andrew Goodman, um, and yeah, and, and, and Mahoney Schwager. I think uh, how would I rate their support? I, I'm, I'm very lucky um, to, to have those uh, calibers, or, no, that caliber of coaches around me, and and, um, and I think the you know, the boys and, and the mums are more will um, will be a lot better for their experience. Mm. Oh, it's strange actually having a team play on field. Yeah, it's it's been a while, <laughs> I think, um, and um, it's, it's been exciting. As, as Michael alluded to, it was, it was weird last week with no crowd, but um, yeah, it was, it was nice to. To hear fans cheering and, and great to see you know, blue jerseys on the field again. It's uh, it's been a long time, so we're, we're very happy. Well, it's nice, nice to run out of the blue yeah, <clears throat> um, yeah. Obviously, it's been a while um, since the last time we got to play um, as a team. Yeah, and we're grateful that we get to to be in a country that's COVID-free and, and be able to do that. So. Um, yeah, grateful to New Zealand that they're able to host um, Manu Samoa and, and get us out in the field because um, yeah, it's been too long since we played last, so um, that's grateful. Yeah.